Today, Toko-san and I swapped lunches just as usual. We ate them together in the club room. The one she made was especially delicious. Thanks for the lunch. Yours was even better, especially the eggs. That'd be great, thanks. Toko-san takes out a book and starts writing. Oh, you have it on you. Yeah, duh, I was there with you yesterday. Toko-san's holding the diary we brought together. You're carrying it around with you? Yeah, it's hard to keep up with things you're not used to. Huh? No, I'm not. It was a pain making them just for myself. Wait, does it taste bad? No, thank you for your amazing lunches. Oh, well, a bit. Not at all. Lunch wasn't why I was late. No, I felt fine. I just overslept. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's just a bit of an awkward subject. I really want to deny it, but if I do, she'll ask me why I was actually late. I spent this morning in the cafe talking to Soma-san. It was there I found out that Toko-san's probably a former help. Even if I managed to explain everything in a way she understood, that would just give her something to worry about, so I figured it's best not to say. I can't exactly say that to Toko-san now, considering she doesn't even know what an help is anymore. Huh? Holding back what? ネブスクになるぐらい一人で激しいのをするなんて、いわゆる溜まってる状態なんじゃないかと。もし私のことを気遣って無理に我慢とかしてるのなら引ってくれていいんだよ。ほ、おお、ノー、ダッツノット。本
私別に嫌な思いなんてしてないよ気持ちよかったよ最初は痛いってよく聞いてたし実際に入った直後は痛かったんだけど気づいたら気持ちよくなっててもしかしたらああいうのが相性バッチリってことなのかな Yeah, maybe. I don't think it would have been like that with just anyone. うん。特別だよね。それぐらい気持ちよかったから。あのまま気持ちよくなって行ってみたいなって。これも恋の勉強の中に入ってると思うんだよね。だから私を行かせてくれる。Is she serious? No man's crotch, er,、uh, I mean dignity, would allow turning that request down.、Uh, I'll do my best. <laughs> Toko san smiles sweetly. She then leans toward me and whispers into my ear. <laughs> Her erotic tone elicits a base, instinctual reaction in me. My whole body tenses up like she's grabbed hold of my heart directly. Toko san. Threads of saliva form between our mouths each time we separate. Our heated breaths intermingle as our sloppy kiss continues. <laughs> Hold on a second, we can't go any further. <laughs> Did you already forget what we agreed to? We have to be careful not to get carried away at school. So. Don't try and wiggle your way out of this. You did agree to that with me, yes? Not an intense one like that. I'd gladly kiss you all day outside of school, though. Hontoni? You bet. Hakata. Ima wa sono kotoba dake de manzoku shite oku yo. Sore ni, buhitsu wa minna de tsukau basho nan da kara. Anmari hen na koto shite dame da yo ne. Exactly. Things would get awkward if everyone found out about this. They'd probably be grossed out. Though that doesn't mean we could just switch rooms and everything would be fine. So then, um, how about we have dinner together? You did? Um, this person wouldn't happen to be a boy, would it? Well, yeah, but I don't think it matters. I can tell I have nothing to worry about from the way you are talking. But it's no one I need to be worrying about, is it? Your lawyer, the one in charge of your inheritance? So, so, I'm not here, I'm 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 here, I see.
Oh no, you gotta do what you gotta do. I'd have to make dinner for my dad and stuff anyway. Still, her lawyer, huh? That'd be sweet. Oh, I mean, I'd love to. Please, let's. Uh, I'll do my best. Hmm, this weekend. No, I'm just wondering what my dad's plans are. He might be a workaholic, but even he takes some weekends off. I'd feel bad telling him to get out of the house on his day off. Huh? Your place? Uh, are you sure? Great, I'd love to. Okay. We lock up with the key we borrowed from Ayachi-san. Let me just double check it. Looks okay. So, on another note... Your lawyer seems to know a lot about your family. Do you look a lot like her or something? You really look that alike? That's pretty unusual. そうだね。面影があるとかならわかるんだけど、本人そのままっていうのはなかなかないよね。じゃあ寂しいけど、チャイムが鳴っちゃうから戻らないとね。いや。Exactly well, anyway, I should start focusing on our upcoming date. Speaking of that... I can't stop thinking about what she said earlier. I know I said that I'll do my best, but I only just lost my virginity. I didn't know if I have the experience to handle this. I better study up then. There's no point in me leaving on my own, so I'll help out. ありがとう。でも戸隠先輩どうしたんでしょう。人と会う約束があると聞きましたよ。I've heard all about it. She's not doing anything worth worrying about. Thus, for the first time in a long while, I clean up with everyone else, then head home alone. However, I realized something along the way. All right, we are running out of detergent. I should buy some. Let's see. I got the detergent and some salt. Don't think we needed anything else. I'll start making dinner as soon as I get home. Hmm? Huh? Is that Toko-san? I'd know that back anywhere. But as soon as I see her, she's swallowed by the crowd of shoppers and commuters, and I lose track of her. Toko-san, wait! Huh? I could have sworn she went this way. I don't see her anywhere. Was I seeing things? Well, it's not like I need her for anything, I guess. 
I figured she was meeting her lawyer closer to her place, but I guess she's meeting him around here? I mean, the station is the most obvious meeting spot, at least. All you've got around here are suburbs, the school and a hospital. Oh, and some restaurants, too. They could be meeting in one of them. She did say the lawyer was pretty old. Oh well, time to go home. Yeah, got a date. The morning of our weekend date has arrived. As usual, I'm eating breakfast with my dad. Yeah, probably. Do you have work today? Cool. Which means he could be back at any time, really. I'm glad I decided to go to Toko-san's house today. Please don't say that with a blush. Don't worry about me, we planned on meeting up outside today, so feel free to get home whenever. You sure? Thanks. Trust me, Dad, I'm very worried. I've been studying, but will I do all right? Huh? For real? Well then, um, do you have any tips on how to make a girl c come? To enjoy squid? Of course I can't ask my dad how to make a girl come. In fact, I can't talk about this with anyone. I end up heading off for my date with my mind still clouded in anxiety. <laughs>